All right, guys, so it's been a while since we've got a big update for EA Sports PGA Tour, but the biggest one probably to date so far is coming out today. It should be out already, so it's come kind of come out of left field. There hasn't been much uh, marketing around it, much hype around it, but I'm sure that will all start to change today. And we saw that uh, they tweeted out, uh, well, they retweeted the Masters tweet that the Masters Par 3 course will be coming to the course, but that's not all. There's three major courses coming. Jack Nicklaus is coming, and yeah, these are are all going to be added to career mode and everything we'll have a look here at the three courses well the four courses technically and they're all major courses even though of course the masters par 3 course isn't the full major course or whatever you know what i'm talking about when i say that um it's a part of the uh it's a part of the experience you know at augusta and augusta has such a rich history um it's awesome i will be doing a video later on today that you have to look out for um with jack nicholas playing the par 3 course at uh, augusta and this is why i wanted to wait as well to start my new male career mode because obviously uh the three new courses that are um valhalla which is hosting the 2024 pga champion championship pinehurst which is hopefully uh hoping which is hosting rather the 2024 us open and then royal troon which is hosting the 2024 open championship so that's absolutely awesome all these courses will be uh, of course added to online added to a career mode and this is a huge update man and i'm really excited about it so we're gonna actually load up the game here and just have a look at the courses in game and stuff so season 11 is here it's live there's a new pro pass of course and uh you can start to unlock that and, and purchase that now um and then we'll go in here and have a, just a quick look at the quick play section so stroke play let's just have a look at the new courses here we have augusta national par 3 course 1090 yards uh the traditional par 3 contest takes place the day before the masters players are often accompanied by children grandchildren and their significant others i doubt this will be a part of career mode just because that would take a lot of work to just put in a random par 3 event before the masters i mean that would be really cool but I somehow doubt it. But then we have Pinehurst number two, Donald Ross's masterpiece number two at Pinehurst has served as the site of more single golf championships than any other course in America. It's 7,588 yards, uh, a par 70. And of course, this will be hosting the US Open for 2024. So you know, it's going to be a tough course. And I can't wait to see all these courses in game. I, of course, will be uh, playing them um in career mode as a part of career mode i'll probably check out around me and alex will do a match on all these new courses of course uh then you have valhalla here par 71 7609 yards roughly the same distance as the u.s open course pinehurst number two uh set amongst kentucky horse farms the jack nicholas designed valhalla has hosted four pga championships and a Ryder cup in its short history and of course will be the venue for the 2024 pga championship as well and then we have royal troon which is really cool that we have another european course in here um a par 71 uh similar distance again in uh, located in the rugged uh, the rugged scotland here located near the firth of clyde royal troon is a lynx course that opened in 1878 with just five holes expanding to 18 holes by 1888 everton were actually founded in 1878 as well um my my football club so yeah cool to see all the, all these uh, these four new courses at the front here and let's just click in and just see if we can see jack nicholas here there he is young jack nicholas in all his glory his powers way up up there is driving accuracy and control his way up there and he is probably going to be one of the best players in the yeah he's a 99 overall <laughs> he's a 99 overall holy shit balls he's going to be fun to play as so i will have a round with the golden bear later today stay tuned for that this was kind of just a short video to kind of update you guys on what's going on here and what uh there is a big new update for the game and uh this is, has kind of given me hope because i was starting to lose hope here that they were updating the game we kind of just seen so little for so long that i was starting to just be a little bit concerned about the uh the state of the game and um yeah i mean this has got me excited again uh hopefully the online servers start to uh start to fill up again a little bit more as well um i think they've they've kind of added in a few new things for online so if i went into tournaments i assume they have the masters tournament ready to go here now the daily tournaments i assume the seasonal one is going to be augusta here of course that it is yes it is augusta national seasonal tournaments so uh those will be there for you if you want and if you want to play online you can go in here and i think they've uh they've done a few changes here of course now they are changing every uh 24 hours they're changing the um the matches here which i think is really cool to keep it fresh and keep it uh uh, keep it kind of going without uh, getting bored of playing the same courses and playing the same difficulties and the same everything. So uh, that's kind of cool. 
Um, so yeah, check out the online. Let's try and get these servers uh, back up here for the new update and see if uh, if they've really um, made a made a difference to the game. Now, career mode is something that I'm really excited about because I am starting two new career modes. So to have three courses in rotation for the major championships, except Augusta, of course, which will always stay as Augusta. But for the other three majors, all three of them now have three courses rotating each season. So you'll you'll not be playing the same courses over and over again, which I really really like actually. So we're gonna see um, like quite a big shift each season um with the major championships which is uh which is cool but anyway um i wanted to keep this one short and sweet i just wanted to kind of update you guys on the new update we have uh jack nicholas we have the masters part three course we have the three major courses for 2024 a lot of people were curious on whether that would happen or not let's have a quick look at the pro pass here as well to see if there's uh some cool stuff i believe a lot of it is focused on jay lindebag so um We'll come all the way up here. Ooh, that's a that's a shaft. You got caps, got golf bags. Um, I've never thought that the the pro passes in EA Sports PGA Tour were that good, to be honest. Like they just don't have enough. Like it's a lot of it is just XP and coins. Um, so I've never been like, oh my god, these are amazing. But some of the shirts later on here are definitely looking pretty cool. The caps look cool. Um, we got some clubs here. Oh, are those Jack Nicholas's clubs? They might have Jack Nicholas's clubs and gear in here, actually, in the in the Pro Pass. I think that they do. Uh, yeah, look at that. He has his own set here. Jack Nicholas, the main man. That should be uh, that should be awesome to actually unlock those eventually as well. I'll, I'll probably be using them at some point um, in career mode, maybe. Um, but all the way here. There's a, is there a hundred tiers on this one? Usually I don't. Is there always a hundred tiers? Ninety. Okay. 90. Oh, yeah, the Hovland shirt there. Look at that. The Hovland shirt is the final tier with a, a fitting of a color I don't even think that they've shown before. I don't know. Anyway, guys, thank you so much. Stay tuned for the career mode. Stay, stu stay tuned for the Masters video later today. Stay tuned for all my new content coming up. We got a lot of stuff coming up here on the channel. Topspin 2K25 is not too far away. And uh, yeah, I've just got a whole bunch of stuff planned. Course vlogs are coming soon. I got the new microphone here. Um... I'll switch over to the full camera. I got the new course mic mics. Me and Alex are going to be booking the flight soon uh, for him to come over and record a couple course vlogs and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, I just thought I'd kind of give you guys a quick update here before I get into the gameplay and uh, and show this off. I, I know that you guys are always eager for uh, news on the, on the new games and stuff like that. So here you are. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. Peace out.